Britain must wake up to the power of Africa. Africa is no longer a colonial subject. It must be seen as an investment opportunity Britain is losing out on, often because of our prejudices. In a world where the center of gravity is moving from America to China, China has recognized the power of Africa from investment to empowering its human capital. Between 2004 and 2009, Chinese investment in Africa has grown by over 40% annually. Africa's middle class is booming. 34% of the African population is middle class. Its consumer spending is expected to reach $2.2 trillion by 2030. Manufacturing jobs are moving to Africa. Made in China will become made in Africa. Africa could be the future for Theresa May if Europe closes door on Britain. Its combination of macroeconomic growth, steady democracies, a rising consumer class, infrastructure development, and abundant natural resources make it the perfect investment opportunity. Some African development experts argue that in fact, the UK must leave the EU in order to enable our mother continent to negotiate a more equitable trade agreements with the United Kingdom. Britain is moving in the right direction. UK investment in Africa has more than doubled between 2005 and 2014, from 20.8 to 42.5 billion pounds. But this movement is far too slow. If Theresa May doesn't recognize the future of Africa in a post-Brexit world, it will only harm the British economy.